Hi guys, it's Barbara with Quartz Rose Tarot. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you're notified when I upload new content. This reading is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. So let's get into the reading Sagittarius and then we'll get into all 12 signs around Sagittarius. So with that, Holy Spirit, Angel, Spirits, and Guides, Clarity, and Guidance for Sagittarius, please. Somebody's going to have justice moving on. So let's get into the energy of all 12 signs around Sagittarius, starting with Aries. You're dealing with an Aries. Somebody's trying to win at all cost, playing mind games with love. I feel like if you're dealing with a Taurus, Taurus is emotionally communicating to their Ten of Cups the truth. So the truth is coming out with a... Um, Taurus, if you're dealing with a Gemini, somebody needs strength because of strife, jealousy, competition. Um, they're a little guarded. They're a little guarded needing some strength because there's a lot of competition and drama going on. If you're dealing with a Cancer, you have the Queen of Wands. Someone's blocking a Queen of Wands. They're blocking the Queen of Wands apology. So if you're dealing with, this could be you, Sagittarius. Um, you have a cancer that may be blocking or standing their ground it has to do with an apology or an offer. I feel like they may be blocking your apology. If you're dealing with a Leo, someone speaking a harsh truth, they're working on regret. So, um, someone regrets speaking a harsh truth and now they're trying to work on it. They're trying to work on whatever this is that they spoke. If you're dealing with a, with a, um, Virgo, somebody is, you have somebody from the past that's single. There may be something hidden about somebody who's single from the past. If you're dealing with a Virgo, if you're dealing with a Libra, Libra is looking back at past mistakes. There may be, um, I feel like harsh communication about some, some passionate communication about deception. So somebody is figuring out that there was deception in the past and there's a fight about it. If you're dealing with, if you're dealing with a Scorpio, Scorpio, there's options with this Scorpio. Someone's waiting to master their emotions. This could be about an option. Someone's waiting, King of Cups, waiting, King of Cups, yearning, waiting, and yearning. Um, it has to do with an option, illusion, confusion, daydreaming. I feel like it's not, this person's waiting for an option here. They're waiting for their options to open up. They're trying to master their emotions, waiting for their options to open up. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, another Sagittarius, there's a victory, and someone's holding on to their victory. They're hoping to hold on to their victory. <laughs> That's exactly what that is. They're hoping to hold on to a victory. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius. If you're dealing with a Capricorn. Uh, so there's a, a closing out of a cycle for an emperor. Uh, somebody's trying to be patient to close out a cycle. Emperor energy. Taking control. Standing in his power. If you're dealing with an Aquarius. I feel like Aquarius uh, once equal give and take, and they want to be with somebody in a relationship. And if you're dealing with a Pisces, somebody is juggling a third party, and they somebody needs to heal from somebody juggling a third party. Under the bottom of the deck just happened to be the Queen of Cups. So Pisces energy needs to heal from a third party situation. So your energy is somebody's moving forward to justice. So somebody wants justice in a situation or their justice is moving on. It could go either way. So let's see what's going on for Sagittarius. So with that, Holy Spirit, angel spirits and guides, clarity and guidance for Sagittarius, please. What does Sagittarius need to know? What does Sagittarius need to know? What does Sagittarius need to know? Okay. Divine timings at play for a new beginning of passion. Someone's heartbroken over the competition and betrayal and the burden. Ooh, okay. They're not speaking. 
They're walking away from a king of cups, cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio energy. Um, someone's being very strategic, not showing emotion where this empress is concerned. And a king of wands, you have a king of wands. I feel like this could be, it could be two people, could be three people. But let's see what's going on. The justice for somebody trying to win at all cost. Somebody's needing strength. Very guarded and defensive about it ending. And they're unhappy about it. Under the bottom of the deck, you have a victory. Somebody's getting a victory here. So the energy for the second Sagittarius was was trying to hold on to their victory. So I feel like... There is somebody having a new, it's somebody's, somebody's heartbroken over the competition and the betrayal and the burden. Divine timing is at play with this new passionate beginning, whatever this is. If somebody's not speaking, they're just walking away, trying to master their emotions, being strategic where this empress is concerned. And it could be you, Sagittarius. Um, Sagittarius energy, king of wands, where the empress is concerned. You're both looking in opposite directions. So let's see what's going on. So someone is very stressed out in divine timing, king of swords energy, right? Trying to master their emotions for a new passionate beginning, heartbroken and not speaking about it. Competition with the empress. Somebody's in competition with the empress and they don't like it, right? They feel like they've been betrayed for a long time and there's a lot of burden with the strife, jealousy and competition. Somebody's not speaking about the deception. They're walking, they're manifesting, walking away. Somebody's trying to master their emotions about this third party situation and they're being very strategic and they want to speak a harsh truth to the empress. Truth is where the empress is, right? So speaking a harsh truth to the empress. It could be the empress in this case, um, or there was a lot of competition with the uh, around the empress. So it could be if you're the empress here, there was a lot of competition around you. And you you could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, or Sag. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, or a Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. So what's this King of Wands? The King of Wands single pre-empress, right? So they want to speak the truth about being single. This empress, why this empress is single is because they're, they're overwhelmed with the nonsense. They're heartbroken about the competition and they're over it. So the justice for all the nonsense and needing strength Queen of Wands, this is you, Sagittarius. There's passionate communication about this broken heart. Like, you broke my heart, and now I'm done. I'm walking away, right? Um, they're very guarded and defensive about this ending, and they're unhappy, right? It's causing a tower moment. Somebody's very guarded and defensive um, about this Ten of Cups, looking back at past mistakes, and they want to move forward and take that leap of faith. You have an emperor here. So this is a true match to you. But you know what? The the eleven eleven may be blocked right now because there's an offer here or an apology to get justice. But will there be equal give and take moving forward? If this person has put you through all of this mind games, it's kind of the theme this week, guys, is I'm seeing that, you know, somebody put you through a, a whole mess of garbage, right? And And now that you've decided to take control of you and move on. They're running with their tail between their legs, trying to get you back. And I feel like with that, see with that queen of wands, passionately communicating about the broken heart, walking away. In other words, I've had enough. I'm not doing this anymore, right? Sanctuary, I want a safe place to lay my head, right? Um, you know, gentleness, I feel like this is just you just just being in yourself, you know, um, you don't have to fight about it. You don't have to do nothing. You can just be within yourself, right? And playfulness. Strength. I feel like you need the strength to go, get out and, and enjoy something. That playfulness, I almost feel like that's out with friends enjoying things single right? You are no longer going to deal with this, but you need the strength to do that because I feel like you've been through a lot and you kind of might be carrying around a lot of burden with you right now. You might be feeling a little bogged down in the situation, but you know, that light's shining on you. So you will be moving forward here. Yeah. Seek a union with mind and spirit. Um, Shields, you are safe from harm. 
You are safe from harm. You are protected. Conflict and danger lie in wait. So they want you to know is even though this is kind of, you know, they got their sword out, right? King of swords. Even though you feel like there's conflict and danger, you're protected. They want you to realize how you are protected from this nonsense. Be meticulous and patient. Let your intentions be known. I feel like darkness, darkness looms on the horizon for this emperor because, you know, they've caused their own nonsense. This person has been the cause of their own problems. But they try to pass them off on other people. I, somebody needs to hear that. Even though they're guilty, they want to make their problems your problems, right? Apology, they're going to apologize, but you're going to make a decision because there's no trust in this situation or stability. You don't feel trust and stability in this situation with this person, right? You've overcome anything you've needed to overcome as far as spiritual lessons. You've been more than patient. Um, you're on different pages now. You're on different pages. You're not ready. You're not going to you're not ready, willing, or able to put up with this nonsense any further. So guys, that's all I have for you. If this resonates, I think I'm going to take this to Vimeo for the extended. So don't forget to like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, and I will see you over in Vimeo for the extended.